last time on Tree's Company. Marvin was having X problems, Eugene was watching Star Wars, and Terry was tired of their bullshit, whisking them off to a rather taz nasty party hosted by the local master of festivities, Oz. Hmm. With the encouragement of some happy pizza and push from his master, Eugene embarked on a journey of self-discovery. Marvin encountered the aforementioned ex-Gloria, who proceeded to give him a sound verbal threshing. Ouch. Terry eloquently saved the day by calling her a cunt, thus ushering in a night of merriment and fox-trotting. And so begins the morning after. Terry! What? What happened last night? Looks like we had a moment. Hopefully not with each other. Oh, you're nasty. Go. That is killing me. Dude, Super Cunt told you you were fired last night. You don't remember? God, I'm so glad I got your ass fired. I kind of remember. Go in there and get up all in your boss's shit and go to Super Cunt's lair and put your miso soup in her coffee. I'm not gonna piss in her coffee. Look, last night she called you a dog. A dog. Why don't you go in there and show her how much of a dog you really are? Hey, faggy fit. Can you pass me those bottles over there? Thank you. Did she expect me to drink that? It's my head's on cook. I'm cured for hangovers. <coughs> and yes, you will drink it. And you will uh, love it. No, I'm not. <coughs> Eugene, you drink. <coughs> Eugene, you drink! What the hell, man? Oz, where's Eugene? I don't know, man. What do you mean you don't know? You're wearing his helmet. I got this at the party last night, man. Because of that girl was all covered in throw up. And she came by. I got it, man. She's probably with that chick he was macking on, man. Yeah. Did you say macking? Yes, he just said macking. Eugene has my keys and I have to get to the office. What am I gonna do? Hey man, you guys got a light or something, man? There's a lighter somewhere over there on the table. Look, Marvin, chill out. Just take my keys and go handle your shit, all right? But what about Eugene? I can't believe we just left him. Dude, he's probably still at the party with the lightsaber in one hand and the other one up his ass. Yeah, man, we go look for him like, uh, like, cracking in tubs, man, from Miami Vice. Just, I can feel it going the air All right, night. I guess I can drop you guys off and, you know, hit you up when I'm done, all right? All right, dude. We'll be downstairs. Let's go, Cockless and Tubby. Man, I'm Crocky. You're Tubby, man. Hold on. Huh? And I've been waiting for a moment. Oh, my life. All right, guys. Give me a call. We got to find Eugene, all right? All right, man. Damn, Oz. We're the craziest parties. Hey, man. This ain't a party, man. This is just a small get you get. This was a small get together? Yeah, man. If this was a party, the walls wouldn't even be standing. Hey, man, if you just seen the party I threw for Dylan, dude, this is awesome. Whoa. Had chicks and strippers and donkeys and there's a pole and watermelon and we love watermelon. And they had all kinds of midgets, dude, and freaking peanut butter and jelly and you can't find them for you. No unicorns, though, dude. Oh, shit! There she is right there, man! Dude, that's disgusting. It looks like the thing. She must eat like chips or something, man, dude. Oh, it's alive! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, 
Looks like you tried to get to the toilet, but didn't make it. No, I was in the closet, and this guy, he, I was making out with him, and then he just, like, started saying crazy shit about rainbows, and then all of a sudden he started puking on me, and then I ran over here to the bathroom. Cool story, bro. Have a nice day, man. Nice lady. Dude, your jeans not here. Hey, man, I can't even remember last night, man. All I remember is drinking with y'all and partying, and you up at your house. Yeah, and you know, cheap. Why don't you let me go? I mean, for all I know, the girl just left with the one he was making out with last night. I don't know, man. Who knows? I think I know where he is. Meanwhile. Hey, Marvin, did you see the TPS report this morning? Jerry! Expedition is going outside. Jerry! Marvin? Listen up and listen up carefully. I spent two years at this shit of a firm making sure it doesn't fall to pieces. Now that I'm fired because your cut of a niece broke up with me. I didn't deserve this, Jerry. I wasn't gonna fire you. I was gonna promote you. You're definitely getting fired. Get everything out of the office and get it out of here. If you come to my niece or come to this office again, I'm happy to arrest him. Pokai, I don't! Go in her lair and put your miso soup in her coffee. No, Marvin, don't do it. Shut up, Eugene. Okay, Terry. Should I do it? Do it. Do it. I dare you. You know I can't do it when you're watching. <laughs> it's Wednesday, and if you're a Star Wars or comic book nerd, this is the place to be. I love this place, man. Hey, how are we gonna find him in this place, man? Eugene's a special looking guy. I'm sure we'll find him. Hey, man, there he is over there! What's up, man? What's going on? Yeah, we're on our chapter five. Get the hell from me. And who are you calling, Jack? All y'all look alike. So do you, Korean barbecue? Hey, man, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. We're, we were looking for somebody, man. He kind of looks like you. His name is Eugene. Oh yeah, I know him. He has a helmet signed by the entire Star Wars cast, which includes Jeremy Brook, the actor who originally played Joe Bohe. I've been trying to get it from him for like years now. Have you seen him today, man? No, he's probably training with um, Jungle Gym. Hey, what did you say about the Jungle Gym, man? I mean, thank you, man, thank you. May the force be with you. Fuck you! Whatever, man. You ain't gotta be a dick, man. I think I know where that guy lives. It's around the corner. Oh, what if the, what if the aliens got him, man? You know, they stick things in there, you know? The aliens and the, and they got the, the probes and they shove them in your ass and they check to see if you, you know, see where you're at. Man. What they do, man? Help you, how may I? What? Is Eugene here? The young Padawan you seek, not seen I have. A story to tell you I do. Step inside my home you may. What the fuck is he talking about, man? So you know where he's at or not? Last night away sent him on a quest. I did. What the? What quest? A quest of seven minutes in heaven. Away I see him after. I did not. Uh, seven... Huh? What's him on this? What? 
Master, is my training complete? No, my young Padawan. To the bedroom you must go. Finish training. We are not. Oh. What's up, Chrissy? Hey, Oz. What? Hey, man, no, it ain't like that, man. It's just, you know, she smoked my joint. She man. what? I mean, not, not my joint, man. <laughs> you know, smoked it. Hey, man, don't you be giving me those googly eyes, you cock ass bastard. Now, y'all gotta bounce. Bounce you here, sweet cheeks. Hey, man, what do you want, my cock, man? Look, man, the force is with us, man. May the force guide you out of my house. A word of advice. Meditate about your friend, you should. Strong with the force he is. Hangover move you guys remind me of. Alright, Master, Mr. Jungle Jim, man. Take care. It's Master to you, asswipe. Now leave. How old are we gonna do? I don't know, man. But I couldn't understand a word he was saying. Speaking of rhymes and shit. After living with Eugene for a while, you start to pick up on the nerdy lingo. Oh, I don't know. He was talking about aliens and the hangover. Dude, I love that movie, man. When they go on the roof and shit, and they get him and he's all burnt, dude. It's awesome. Us, you're a genius. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, it's... It, no. Tattooed circus midgets? What? Never mind, let's go. <laughs> Marvin, Marvin, dude, I can't find Eugene. Oz and I have been looking for him all day. Dude, we fucked up last night. Terry, don't fuck with me right now. Dude, I'm not fucking with you. Look, we went back to the house where the party was at, and he wasn't there. Then we went back to see his boyfriend, some fool he calls Master, and he sent him on some stupid ass quest. Tell him about the aliens. The aliens, man. What quest? Something about seven minutes in heaven. It's a bad vice. Shut up. No one at the party saw him? Thing girl did. Thing girl? Some chick covered up in puke on the bathroom floor. God, shut up. Be outside. I'm coming to get you guys. What about Eugene? I know where he is. Not here. Eugene. Marvin. 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 Hold on. Hey man. This thing takes the type of woman. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta caress it. You hear that? And you like it. And then you grab it and Thanks guys. What the f Eugene! I missed you. Oh no not again. Oh. Stop that. Get him up. Oh. Shit, what happened to you? I don't know. I just... Master told me to go to seven minutes in heaven. And then I had a shot. And I had some of that pizza. Oz, I think that pizza was old, man. <laughs> you had the happy pizza, man. You had the happy pizza. And, and then I, this girl took me to the closet. So I'm like just... With this girl, right? And then this feeling started coming out of my stomach. And coming out of my mouth. There's rainbows. Rainbows coming up like like ecstasy, except real. And have you ever made love with an oyster? It's all 
So squishy and you, you, yeah, man, that's awesome. Do you guys are trying to do tell me? And then, then the girl disappeared. Let's go home. mission here is done, man. Catch you guys on the flip side. Thanks, Austin. All right, man. Love, peace, and Afro Grease! Hey! Where's my shirt? Thank you! I can't believe you got fired. You know what, at least you broke off things with Gloria. It's all good. She dumped me. Oh. You couldn't be in a cup? I get a little stage for when people are watching, all right? You guys used to fuck. She's seen your dick before. It's a pressure of her watching. <laughs> at least you knocked your coffee over. It's a step in the right direction. Well, here's the one hell of a day. At least it can't get any worse, right? Hey, what are we doing about rent? <laughs> <laughs>